special edition of Project Cleanup. So much destruction in the city that needs to be cleaned. More on that in a moment. Our Fuller and Sons crew made their way to the Barrio area to help sweep things up there. The target was the alley on Southeast 16th between Johnson and Lincoln, moving south to north. The crew found all kinds of debris that needed to be dumped. One of the strangest items this time around, how about some railroad ties wrapped in carpet? Hmm. Well, the most common item this trip, several nasty mattresses and box springs. And with all the rain we've had, they are now soaked in havens for mosquitoes. And like all the rest of what was taken away from the alley, found a temporary home at the roll-offs in the parking lot of the downtown library. And while we're talking roll-offs, a reminder, they are in several parks for residents who need to be rid of junk and debris, not for commercial use by contractors and builders that's a friendly reminder. In the meantime, the Fuller and Sons crew just keeps on keeping on making Amarillo cleaner. We're really proud of what has been accomplished here within the city of Amarillo. We think it shows what can happen when uh, the private and the public come together to fix what is a problem. Um, there's a lot of work that we have done. There's a lot of work yet to be done. And we're going to stay hooked up with this thing and, and try and, and help make Amarillo cleaner, help make Amarillo a better place to live. And something else we want to tell you about, several local organizations and groups are joining forces to help clean up trash at Medi Park. This will be a massive project cleanup. The city of Amarillo says trash and debris are collecting in local playas and lakes, including at Medi Park. The public cleanup will take place Saturday from 9 until noon. Another cleanup will happen next Saturday at McDonald Lake from 9 until noon. To sign up, go to newschannel10.com. We're also trying to coordinate a project cleanup for Lawrence Lake in the near future. We'll certainly keep you up to date on that initiative. If you know of an area that needs to be picked up, straightened up, or cleaned up, go to newschannel10.com and go to Project Cleanups tab. We'll let you know uh, what you uh, have written in there. We'll try to get there for sure. Again, the roll-offs at San Jacinto Park, the library, and other areas are not for commercial use. They're meant for residents who are doing their part in making and keeping Amarillo beautiful.